welcome to my channel. Today we are going to see how to make fish biryani recipe. I have shared the detailed recipe in my video. So now let's go into the video and see how to make it. Okay, first let me start making my marination masala. So let me add 2 big tablespoon of yogurt and then 2 tablespoons of corn flour, 2 tablespoons of chili powder and required amount of salt. Now let me mix the ingredients until it forms in this consistency and pour 1 tablespoon of lemon juice. Here I have cleaned my fish pieces. Now let me add them one by one in my marination masala. For 1 kg of rice, I am using 1 kg fish here. Nicely combine the masala along with the fish pieces. Now let me marinate this in my freezer for 20 minutes. Now in my cooking vessel I have required amount of water along with 4 to 5 pieces of cloves and required amount of crystal salt and 3 pieces of cinnamon 2 pieces of cardamom In this let me add 1 tablespoon of ghee or clarified butter and 1 tablespoon of cooking oil Now in a high flame until the water comes to boil cook it After the water comes to boil it looks like this Now I have 1 kg of rice here. I have soaked it in the water for half an hour. Now let me add it in my boiling water. If the rice piece gets divided into 3, this means that the rice is 70 percentage cooked and now you can filter it in this stage. The water which settles down, you can throw it. Now keep the rice aside. In a bowl, let me add two eggs and required amount of salt, and let me mix it. And let me heat my pan and add required amount of oil for frying the fish. After marination, let me take a fish piece and dip it into the beaten egg, and let me fry it. Like this, repeat the process for the fish pieces. Once one side is cooked. Now flip the sides. And then now let me transfer this in the plate. I have two onions chopped. You have to chop like this and start frying. For 5 minutes once, saute it until it becomes to a golden brown color. Now I have transferred the fried onion to a plate. In the same oil where I have fried the onions, let me add few pieces of cinnamon, cardamom, and cloves. Before adding the spices, please wash them and add it. Now I have my chopped onion. Let me add it into the oil and nicely saute it. And add four green chilies, chopped coriander leaves and mint leaves, two chopped tomato. Let me saute them. Until the raw smell of tomato goes, and let me add two tablespoons of chili powder, one tablespoon of coriander powder, half tablespoon of garam masala powder, and one tablespoon of ginger garlic paste. One tablespoon is enough. Now let me saute it, and then let me add tomato and onion paste and saute it. Make sure that you add two tablespoons of yogurt. The water from yogurt is enough, but let me add quarter glass of water. Let me saute it. Let me add half fried fish. Now, after adding all the fish pieces, now let me take the masala and spread it all over the fried fish pieces. If you are trying this recipe for the first time after combining the fish pieces with the masala separate them and then keep it up of the 70 percentage cooked rice later now let me spread the 70 percentage boiled rice and then let me add 1 tablespoon of clarified butter or ghee i have soaked saffron in the milk now let me pour the saffron soaked milk and add chopped coriander leaves And at last, let me garnish it with some fried onions. 
Now let me close the lid and dump it for 7 to 10 minutes. After 7 to 10 minutes, my rice looks like this. As you can see, the fish piece is super soft and delicious. Now my yummy fish biryani is ready. Try this fish biryani in your home and let me know how is it taste in the comment box. If you want the fish biryani to be tastier, you can also use big fish pieces. Please give a like, comment and subscribe to my channel Sidra's Entertainment. Thank you.